Welcome! In this video, I'm going to show you how to use cues in Helicon Focus 5. Why would you want to use a cue? To save time! If you have a large number of images in a stack, say 80, and all the images are high resolution, it takes quite a while for a computer to process them. While one stack is being processed, you have to sit and wait for the result before you can load the next stack or change any parameters. Instead, we suggest you add several tasks to a queue and go have a cup of tea. When you come back, all your images will be ready for you to compare and enjoy. There are a couple of ways to do this. One is to open a stack, switch to the Parameters tab, open the Run drop-down menu, and select Add to the queue. Now the stack is in our queue. The second way is to open the queue drop-down menu and choose Add Folder. Here I will choose Add All Subfolders. This lets me add several stacks at once. In this folder, I have three subfolders with stacks. I'll add all three. I'm going to add the next stack several times with different processing parameters. Watch how I do this. First, I'll open the folder that contains my images. Set the parameters to default. And add the stack to my queue. Next, I'll try changing the radius parameter and add the stack to the queue again. Finally, I'll change the smoothing parameter and add the stack to the queue once more. Now I have seven stacks in my queue. All I have to do at this point is open the queue, check it, click on the Options tab, confirm or change the choices for saving the stacks, the default will usually be fine, and click on Start. Now I can leave Helicon Focus 5 for a while to do something else, like grab a camera and make more stacks, for example, or have that cup of tea. When the queue is processed, I can see all the resulting images. For example, I can compare three results from the same stack processed with different parameters. Life is short. Using cues will save you a lot of time. Happy stacking with Helicon Focus 5!